Hi, my name is Barry Crampton. Today I'm going to show you around our Range Rover Vogue. Then I'll take you for a ride in it, but first I'll tell you a little bit more about it. It's a 3 litre TD V6 Vogue automatic. 2016 on a 16 plate, one owner from new, has done 40,184 miles. Fuel economy, urban, 36.2 miles per gallon. Extra urban, 44.1 miles per gallon and combined is 40.9 miles per gallon. It has a 0 to 60 time of 7.4 seconds, a top speed of 130 miles per hour out of a 254 brake horsepower, six cylinder, 24 valve engine. Rotex, six months is 145 pounds, 75p, and 12 months is 265 pounds. So at the front, we've got Xenon headlamps, the high pressure headlamp wash, the front parking sensors, multi-spoke alloys, it's sat on continental cross contacts all round, uh, real, real good condition, plenty of uh, tread left on them, the silver blades down the side and the silver roof with the glass panoramic roof set inside. We've also got keyless entry and keyless go, so as so long as you've got the key on your person, if you uh, just touch the handle there, it'll lock it up and when you come back to the car if you put your fingers behind the door handle and it'll open up got the rear privacy glass and it's it's kind of a, a smoky rear privacy glass uh, I'm sure there's a special name for it which I, I can't just recall at the moment but I, I think the idea is to keep the sun off your passengers as, as well as not be able to see in um, We've got the little silver bar that continues from the, the blade there. The silver rear tailgate spoiler. Your rear wiper is underneath there, so it's shielded in, in the winter. Little reversing camera there. And then power open close tailgate. And it's, uh, it's split kind of a 70-30 configuration. Plenty of room in the back. It's got a proper um, alloy wheel and it's a, a full size tire as well and the, the tire's never been on the car and then you've got this hard like load cover there one of the other things that I'll, I'll just show you I'll just close this bottom bit but if you press that button um, both of those close at the same time if you press the bottom bit just the bottom bit closes but here we go we'll just switch that on and then if you're like me and you think uh, tow bars are, are hideous on a car they, they go to all that trouble to design them all in a wind tunnel and make them look nice and then somebody sticks a big blooming lump of metal on the back but there you go that that deploys out from underneath the bumper and then we can put it back like so So, rear parking sensors. Very comfortable in the back. Nice, big, high seat backs. Back seats are like brand new. Meridian speakers all round. You've got the nice panoramic roof, so it uh, it's not claustrophobic it's nice and light and airy in the back you've also got this rear center armrest two cup holders there the isofix fastenings for the rear you know for for your rear child seat heated rear seats and you've got your own climate control switches there so it's it's great to well it's fantastic to drive and it and it's fantastic to be a passenger in one of these two Just take it for riding it. What a day. <laughs> so, we've got uh, two Range Rover keys, the, the little ones here, it's keyless go. So, so long as you've got the key in your pocket, then uh, everything's hunky-dory. You can set off, get in, close the, car up get in the boot whatever 
uh, without taking the key out of your pocket. So now, now I've splashed hand sanitizer everywhere. Let's, uh, I'll just tell you the service history. Great, uh, great service history. Um, 21st to the 7th, 2017, 13,157 miles, Rybrook Land Rover Conway. Uh, 13th to the 8th, 2018, 22,821 miles, Rybrook Land Rover Conway. 24th to the 1st, 2020, 35,719 miles, Rybrook Land Rover Conway. So full main dealer service history. And it's uh, it's done 40,194 miles. <laughs> Just <laughs> wipe that hand sanitizer up. So here we go. We'll set off. Let's say keyless start. So you just uh, press the button as long as you got your foot on the brake. Really nice. Uh, <laughs> this is the highlight of an otherwise miserable day today. Um, let's just do this. It's closing roof doors here. We've got three position memory seats. Let's just try them. Position three. The mirrors, the steering wheel and the seat all moves. Yep. The, oh. There we go, the, the three positions. Now I'll get it something like for me. It's um, you can actually tilt the front and, and, and the back up as well in uh, on this one. It's got lumbar support as well. Let's see. Here we go. Electric tilt and slide steering wheel. You've got the button here. Um, lowers the vehicle when you you pull up, so you can get out easier and get back in easier. The rotary gear knob. I'm just trying to do everything that I can't really do when I'm driving, but here we've got a little cooler compartment. There's USB, um, a power socket, and also auxiliary in. Let's go. So, car's completely different with the with the blind shut. We'll just put that back. Full pan roof. It's a it's a great accessory. Um, one of my favourites. And my other favorite, as everybody who watches knows, is this little button there, the heated steering wheel. We've also got a heated front screen, great on frosty mornings. And they, these, <laughs> these cars just drive so good. Just absorb the bumps power away and uh, plenty of room plenty of room for the passengers as well and their uh, luggage everything about them very very well built solid aluminium bodies on these the later ones we've got automatic we've got sport there just press the button down and holds it in gear longer you can also, well, you, you can actually set it for the paddles only to work in sport or to work in every, everything. Let's, uh, we'll just get this round the roundabout and then see. It's a lovely car. Unfortunately, we're, uh, we're in lockdown at the moment. We can operate on a click and clicked, click and collect policy. Easy for me to say. And um, obviously, I can't do this from home. I'm going to try and work from home as much as I can. But uh, the most important um, thing in my job, anyway, is is videoing the cars because. We, uh, we have a lot of followers and uh, we sell a lot of cars via the internet, uh, via these videos, so I can't do this from home. So before anybody thinks of grassing on me, that's the reason I'm out. And uh, I'll be going home as soon as I've finished. 
Um, having said that, I, I wish I could just keep driving this car because it's lovely. Not been able to get it washed. It's basically just as it's come in. And um, yesterday it, it threw it down all day. So there's quite a bit of uh, grime on the car, but I can assure you underneath it, it's a beautiful looking car in fantastic condition inside and out. It's a nice looking car, the black with the, the silver flash up the side and the silver roof and the and the, the pan, the glass panoramic roof, the big alloy wheels. Just fantastic to drive. Just check all those. We've got here power folding door mirrors. I'll just uh, check that, make sure they're working because this uh, road test is also to make sure everything's working as well. So door mirrors are. Got Bluetooth hands-free, Bluetooth audio streaming. Um, I can demonstrate the Bluetooth audio streaming working, but um, it's getting really difficult these days because although you only play the music for a few seconds, it is getting picked up with YouTube and um, you know they they frown on it as a copyright infringement even though it's only a few seconds that used to be okay but uh, if I turn this down now and um, my phone is over there so I'm not touching it hey Siri play music all right shuffling music from your library so that's going to play music. I'm going to turn the radio down. There's audio. And that's uh, Confident, Demi Lovato. As you can see they're playing on the, uh, through the Bluetooth. You can use it to play your Amazon music, um, Spotify, iTunes, whatever, and it'll pay, play through, even if it's uh, sound from YouTube. Once you've got it set up, anything that is playing, any audio that's playing on your phone will come through the speakers. And you, as you can see, it's like so. You just press that, ah, stop, start, drives me mad. It's uh, such a stupid idea. car weighs two tons every time it stops and starts the, the car shakes which in effect means that the starter motor is moving two tons via the flywheel and everything else all your other suspension components and it, to, to me it just seems like a ludicrous idea uh, to save what is in effect pennies worth of fuel to ruin thousands of pounds of running gear and uh, stuff prematurely and uh, make the replacement quicker so my advice to you is turn that off we've got cruise control on the steering wheel here I'll just set that, it's one touch set, great system in the Land Rover, just press that button at the top, doing 70 miles an hour, just wafting along, 1500 revs, no tyre noise, it's just a, f a fantastic car, um, we're, we're kind of moving to more and more towards just selling Land Rover, Range Rover product. Uh, I'd be a happy man if we did. And uh, we're certainly getting known for it. Our videos are getting lots of views, especially the Range Rovers. We're on, today we'll surpass 18 million views, which is, you know, tremendous and 16,000 subscribers. But the other thing is that um, we, we we're selling cars before they're advertised now. Uh, people watching out, when I say before they're advertised, we're just putting them on the website 
um, not actually paying for any adverts because that's free and obviously YouTube's free and uh, we, we had a 17 plate yet yesterday that's gone already didn't even get a chance to drive it which is extremely annoying but uh, I think when all this uh, lockdown business is done I think I'm going to have to plan a road trip and uh, it, it won't be a sports car I'm going in because these, these are just it, before I switch the cameras on a Mercedes Mustang a Mercedes Sprinter I was just going home uh, to set the cameras up and a Mercedes Sprinter guy pulled out of a side street he was looking that way of course I'm coming this way and he was right the way across the road before he actually turned his head back this way to, to see me there and uh, I mean to be honest it didn't bother me because I know that in this he'd have probably come off worse to be fair but you know if you'd been in a little car a, a Fiat Sagento or something like that I'd have probably had a heart attack thinking about it just a lovely car my favourite colour combination I suppose um, we, we have got a white Range Rover, well we've got two white Range Rovers in at the moment and although they look very very nice I'm getting a bit fed up of seeing white now uh, everything on the road is white and at, w at one time you know people were so fed up of white you couldn't sell them they just new ones especially and it was all, all blacks and silvers but um, obviously the last few years white became very very popular but you can't beat <laughs> you can't beat black with privacy glass um, when I when I used to go and pick my mate up in my Mercedes demonstrator he used to call it uh, well, I see you've come in the Jeff again and of course Jeff Jeff Hurst <laughs> like, that was the idea it looked like a Hurst but classy colours what else have we got well big front central armrest you've got your own separate armrest here you're way up you can see over everybody you feel nice and safe you've got uh, no there's, there's somebody behind me but you've got a reversing camera front and rear parking sensors um gosh what, what else meridian speakers the sound system is really really good i was listening to um well pinball wizard before and uh the intro turned up it's just just awesome and it's real good stereo on that on that track and Pete Townsend's guitars coming out one side and Daltrey singing out the other just it's, it's like well it's like having your own private concert in here while you're doing 70 miles an hour as I say if it, if it it's unfortunate now because of the uh, the copyright things, but um, I just let these people go past me. And just um, test the suspension and the steering up through these the chicane and the S bend. Right, I, I, actually, there you go. So that's that's the reverse. In uh, you see there, you turn the steering wheel and it shows you basically where your tow bar is going to go because of course you've got the electric tow bar as well. And you've got touch image for further options so that's the towing hitch helps you tow let's just do that that'll just show you whereabouts um, you're gonna hit something and then you've got the you've got the goal posts there and also the, the kind of counting down right we'll just get up a little bit of speed so we can load the front end 
that's the sat nav I'll show you how to set the sat nav para mobile delete mobile and uh, stream audio when we get back it's a, it's a bit of a it's a bit of a big car and you do have to be careful coming up this road and and we've just just come across a cyclist right at a bend so that's that's cut me test up let's go we'll we'll give it a flick yeah no worries no knocks or creaks or cracks lovely car have to say that the tires are, are pretty good as well very little noise coming from them and the big tires steering wheel is absolutely toasted air conditioning is working and another thing heated seats this has got heated seats but I always complain in the in the, the uh, other sports I, I complain about the having to switch the screen on and then adjust the heated seats from the screen but in this one with the later switches you see there that switch if you press the seat there and you get the seat showing you can actually turn the seat up and down from this switch without having to do that. So you can turn the fan down. I just knocked it onto hyper cooling there. All the fans coming on. Hyper cooling's not its real name, by the way. Okay, so I'll finish the test drive there and uh, just remind you we've got lot, lots of new cars coming in that I've got to get done. We've got another Range Rover Evoque, which um, I'll try to do as soon as possible. Still got the Mini to do. Got a BMW uh, 335 um, Sprinter van, which has just come in today. Transit van, pl plenty of stuff. So uh, have a look at our website www.ggcars.co.uk If you're watching this video in the future and this, this car's gone, uh, we're always getting Range Rovers in. Oh, uh, while I remember, we, we had a call, somebody who watches the videos and um, asked us to keep a lookout for a specific vehicle and he has people saying Range Rovers, you know, oh, they're unreliable, they're always breaking down and people, of course, they're, they're people that have never had one. But he's got an 88 on an F Range Rover that's done 370,000 miles. So uh, that's um, to the moon and back. Range Rovers are always they're unreliable and always breaking down. Of course they are. Best car on the road. Thanks for watching, see you in the next video.